morning. guys welcome back to romance review tv with lady t and i got another recap for you guys love island usa season four episode four and we have another new bombshell that entered the villa in this episode and two ladies commiserate to find out that they might be getting played so we're going to talk about all of this but before we do if you are new here hit that subscribe button turn on your notifications if you like the video, smash that like button and also feel free to drop a comment down in that comment section below. So without further ado, let's talk about what has happened. So as I stated, a new bombshell enters the villa. New Islander Tyler infiltrates in this episode. And at the start of a new day, this hard body hunk greets the Islanders while chilling out at the pool, leaving the women speechless now deb who is excited about having a new romantic prospect she is gushing in her confessional she said how did the love island gods know exactly what i needed and we know that she's currently single after her first partner jesse recently recoupled with the new girl valerie she also went on to say that it's like one of those grow a boyfriends where you like get him at the store, but you put him on the water and it grows. And I'm like, okay. And then she also talked about that's what happened. Maybe manifestation really works. Now, Deb is not the only girl in the villa kind of charmed by Tyler's looks. And the boys are also taking notice too. Because at one point, Zeta, who is happily coupled up with Timmy, puts her hand on Tyler's sculpted shoulder, talking about she just want a cop of feel. And then we got Maddie talking about, okay, that's a bombshell right now. Now, Maddie, she had already formed a connection with Andy. Now, understandably, Andy seems a tad bit threatened by Tyler's presence. He was like, now there's a guy with really nice hair. And he's like, he's going to take my girl yeah, he said game on. And I'm like, I don't know if that's going to be a competition, Andy, but we'll see. And you know what? I mean, his long hair, his fit physique. I mean, one of those islands couldn't help but to note Tyler's resemblance to a iconic fictional character. And that was Jesse. He's talking about how he looked like Tarzan. And Tyler was like, okay, I appreciate that, man. And pretty much he's known as Tarzan Tyler. Um, you know, he's swinging his way through the villa, unapologetically kissing multiple women during a steamy outdoor game. Now, let's talk about this whole thing going on with this triangle with Jesse, Deb, and Valerie. Now, Jesse, who even after pursuing Valerie, still have feelings for his original pick, Deb. And now he's expressing fears that Tyler might steal one of his love interests away. Now he's also talking about how they need to step up our game. You know, Tyler is into Deb and Val. So if I don't make a decision here soon, he's going to swoop up on me and take one of them. And I don't want him to choose for me and i'm like oh lord they might pretty much put you out the pasture once this happens and we'll talk about that next so he's now the topic of discussion because jesse still seems to be on the mind of both deb and valerie so they have a one-on-one -on -one chat where the ladies take a moment and break down the overlap that they have with mr jesse the courier they're like, you know, you know, that threw me off a little bit when you said that you and him have a strong connection. And he told me that he and I also do have a connection. And then, De and then Zeta was telling me 
that he ranks me as number one. Now, that's Deb telling that to Valerie. Now, Valerie clapped back and revealed that Jesse has been feeding her the same lines. She was like, he told me he ranked me number one. And he told me, like, if there was to be a recoupling, like, would you actually pick me? And he was like, yes, I would. Now, Valerie also tells Deb that Jesse told her, you know, that he was physically attracted to her and could learn so much from her as she was such a smart person. And she was like, well, that's interesting because Zeta told me, literally, he said the exact same thing about me. And that's what Deb says. Now, at this point, Valerie is pissed and I wouldn't blame her. I mean, you, she, he's telling the same stories to two different women. And they were like, you know, if he's telling you the same thing he's telling me, you know, it's like, okay, how do we know what is true? So here's the crazy thing about that. He was already building a connection with Deb. When she came in and that recoupling happening, he ended up being with her by her choosing him. So, is it possible he could have two connections? Yes, but he cannot be telling both of them the same exact things. It looked like he's being a player, and it's not a good look, and it's going to blow up in his face. So, if he's worried about somebody making a decision for him, uh, I think they're going to both make a decision for you, and I wouldn't blame them. And you know what? It don't matter if they end up with Jesse or Tyler. I mean, in, at the end of the day, he's going to snatch somebody's woman because he's the odd man out and he's going to get a vote. Now, um, I know one thing about him. He is super ready to dive into this process with this villain and these women. He was like, the biggest advantage I have is, I mean, look at me. And he's boasting and talking about, I look good. I smell good, I move different, and I will go for the girl that has a boyfriend. And he also said more often than not, the boyfriend, an ex-boyfriend by the end of the night. So, I mean, seriously, he is like, I ain't worried about none of this because I'm finna steal your girl, whoever that may be. And look like it's probably gonna be either between Andy and Jesse's girl, if those two girls don't end up walking away from Jesse, period. So let me know what you guys think. Do you think he's being a player? Do you think he just caught up because of the fact that he was building a connection? And then at the same time, the new girl came in, Valerie, and swooped him up. So now he has two connections. Or is he being a player and he's by him telling, you know, both girls the exact same line? That's what it sounds like to me. And as for Tyler, who do you think, Mr. Tarzan Tyler, who do you think he's going to end up with? Which girl is he going to snatch as his new coupling? So I hope you enjoyed this recap of Love Island USA season four, episode number four. Don't forget to take a second to make sure you're subscribed to this channel. And please don't forget to like and share. We'll see you in the next video. Bye.